heart rate, oh, this is from Brittany. Does heart rate variability have an impact on fibromyalgia? Mine appears low in comparison to the norms I found for my age, but I couldn't find a lot on HRV in general, so I wanted to ask about personal experiences. Thanks. That's an awesome question. Really is. So HRV, heart rate variability, is describing to us how much of a machine your heart is not. Like when there's zero variability, you're running on a pacemaker like a computer and there is no variability in the heart rate. Meaning this, the distance in time between individual heartbeats is supposed to be not constant, but instead they should be closer together or further apart. And the variability shows you just how flexible and reactive your autonomic nervous system is and this uh, heart rate variability reflects that. So when your HRV is low, it indicates that your nervous system is under stress and not able to respond very skillfully or very reactively to what's going on around you. So the measure itself is greater HRV, you're probably a healthier person. Well, since you already are on the fibromyalgia group, we would have to assume that you have an inflammatory condition and with that, you probably have a lower HRV. And it's, it's a secondary thing. When your HRV raise, rises, improves, it will also follow with you being healthier and you having lesser symptoms and lesser trouble when it comes to the rest of your health. The solution? Well, you know me already. Toxicity, malnutrition, stagnation, and trauma. When you resolve these issues, the triggers, the blocking factors that are blocking the natural expression of your homeostatic system, of your body's will to repair itself and function at its best, when that's restored, your HRV will improve too. Go with that. <laughs>